We really appreciate the outpouring of support that we're getting from everybody, law enforcement agencies, the community. Since the weekend, agencies across Indiana are helping patrol Boone County as the Sheriff's Office mourns. And that's only going to expand as we get closer to Deputy Pickett's funeral on Friday. 24 Hour News Eight's Eric Feldman found out how widespread this effort has been. Eric? Yeah, that's right. Departments as close as Lebanon Police and others like the Marion County Sheriff's Office and Indiana State Police, they're taking extra shifts responding to the calls Boone County Sheriff's Office may typically respond to. The law enforcement family has really come together to support the Boone County Sheriff's Office. If you're in Boone County, you may see some unfamiliar squad cars. Whitestown Police Department has been covering quite a bit of the southern part of the county along with Zionsville. Patrolling the county. The Marion County Sheriff's Department, the Hamilton County Sheriff's Department, the Indiana State Police have all been in here helping us on calls. The tragic loss of Deputy Jacob Pickett has rocked the Boone County Sheriff's Office. But Sheriff Mike Nielsen said over the weekend they still have a job to do, protect Boone County. It's been tough on all local law enforcement. We're drained. We're, um, the officers are tired, they're exhausted, but they still come out, they still do their job, they still give it 100%. But those agencies and others are helping. Everybody's been looking out for each other. Lebanon police cover similar spots as the sheriff's office, and they're handling follow-ups to calls typically handled by the sheriff's office. All the extra effort has been noticed by people who live in the county, like Jen Wolf. Coming from a police family, like, and having a brother who's a police officer, it's really important to me that we support our police, and especially in this time. She says a usually quiet Lebanon rocked by SWAT teams on Friday. It was a little terrifying driving through town and seeing AR-15s in police officers' hands. I've never seen that before. Her trust in local police unwavering, but Wolf says law enforcement across Indiana coming together has made a difference. Having people that they trust taking care of their community, and I think that's great. So those outside agencies will be ramping up their patrols starting tomorrow night as the Boone County Sheriff's Office and other local departments like Lebanon and Whitestown PD go to Deputy Pickett's funeral on Friday. Eric Feldman, 24 Hour News 8. Eric, thank you. Visitation for Deputy Pickett is scheduled for tomorrow from 2 to 7 p.m. at Crown Hill Cemetery in Indianapolis. And as Eric mentioned, his funeral services are scheduled for Friday at 11 a.m. at Connection Point Christian Church in Brownsburg. He'll be buried at Crown Hill Cemetery. In honor of Deputy Pickett and his service to the community, Governor Holcomb is directing flags in Boone, Hendricks, Tipton, and Marion counties to be flown at half-staff from sunrise to sunset on the day of the funeral.